Hello Rat Bags, it's Jade with probably the final location guide for all the milk molars. I've done every single area grouped up in separate videos. Go and check them all out if you want every single location for these. Today we're going to focus on the picnic table and the hedge areas. If you find it useful, leave a like. If you want more survival games goodness, then make sure you subscribe. Let's go. So starting off with the picnic table and just a reminder, you can get up onto the picnic table a lot easier now by blowing up this rock underneath the big shovel. There's actually two of the molars below us, but I'm going to start with the top of the table and work our way back down. That's because I want to get out of the way that to open up the Minotaur chest that you find in the Minotaur maze on top, where you can find a gold Mega Milk molar, you do need the special key for it. I haven't shown a way through the maze as it's one of the most simplest you can ever see, and it's not that hard to get on top of. I've already done a full guide on the picnic table as well. Basically, to get the key, just below the picnic bench, in between the bench and the sandbox, there is a broken pipe. Swim all the way through. You might not need any breathing apparatus. It's only a little short pull. There's nothing on this side, so just keep going this way, and there'll be another broken part of the pipe that you can get into. You will need a tier 2 dagger, though, to break through the soggy roots that we're going to find. So there you go. Go away and hack away at it, and you'll get yourself the key. Then it's simply back up to the chest to get yourself the actual Mega Milk. So the reason I've done it like this backwards kind of thing is because before you drop off the table, make sure you jump into the yellow cooler box and that's where you'll find another regular Milk Molar. And then when you're on the ground, you can go and get the other two. First one is situated in the vitamin jar. They have changed this recently, updated it a little bit where they've moved the vitamin jar or made it a bit easier to get into. So it might not look exactly like this, but the actual milk molar is still inside this vitamin jar. And this is the far side of the picnic bench towards the wall, towards the shed. I'm so sorry for the poor choice in scab. I don't know why I used this one, but just to show you where they are. Obviously, it's pretty easy, this one. You don't shouldn't need too much help in finding them on the map. you just got to head to the picnic table. And obviously still underneath, towards the beehive, but not past the big posts, you'll find some bubble gum. You actually need to dig that bubble gum out. And there is the mega milk. Okay, starting with the hedge laboratories now. Obviously at the very start of the hedge where you ascend, just here by the cable. Can be pretty tough to get on top of. You can see you can't really get through it this way. Your best bet is to have a dandelion tough and simply jump like this. Going off the red deck is probably the easiest way to get on top of here. This next one is inside one of the broken lab pieces. Just here, just here. Right, the very, very far corner of the hedge on the ground is another one. It's just past all the wreckage where the laboratory stuff fell to the floor. Just here. Next up, we've got Apricot Punch, which is along the path up towards the laboratory. It's a pretty tough one to get on top of. Pretty much have to clamber up a lot of these. This next one is by the entrance to the tree hedge lab on the mushrooms here. Follow this main branch and we're going to get up that way. You can just about crouch and crawl up the side here. And there you go, you can see a gold one sitting just on the edge here. And there you go, it's just there. If you actually climb all the way up to the top of the laboratories, where you can see all the extra loot and resources that are inside that room there, if you actually jump on top of the branch, you can actually get through. You can get up this way through some of the lower branches as well. This laboratory has been in the game since the very, very beginning, but there hasn't been much ever in it. One little note and that's about it. Well, now there is a brand new molar. This one is a gold one and it's on top of the bird bath. The easiest way to get onto the bird bath is if you've completed the zip line, which is along this branch here. Well, I can't remember if you actually get onto the bird bath that way. Otherwise, climbing the ascent and coming down using another dandelion from some of the branches up there that leads you to the observation pod. Just there. If you go directly out from underneath where the laboratories are, 
towards the big rock wall here, you'll see a golden one sitting just against the wall. And there you go, that's how you to get all of the Milk Molar and Mega Milk locations in the hedge laboratory areas, as well as the picnic table. Hope that's been useful. If it has, leave me a like, make sure to subscribe, so go and check out the rest of the guides, which I've already completed of these, every single Molar location. And I'll see you rat bags later.